in this video I will show you how to import the grid system from AutoCAD to ETAB so that we can draw our beams columns as design uh, or architecture model in the AutoCAD. So here I have created a simple grid system. Here is a distance between two base is 15 feet and 15 feet and similarly in the x direction 10 feet 10 feet 10 feet and uh, in the real models in the architectural you will see grid system and also the walls uh, bed system maybe electrical wiring so uh, for the import to the e tabs you have to delete all the items and you should left only the the grids so here is the grid system so for before the import to the e-tabs you should delete the rest of the items and you should left only the grids here I will also read these grid spacings here now can you can see only the grid system is here I will select all the grid and rename it to only one layer so there are zero def so here is the layer name zero I have assigned and and uh, now I will check the units here the units are the inch system so let's go into the e tabs file new model here is a unit system metric SI and I will select US customary okay and I will take as a blank document because I am importing the grid system from the AutoCAD okay now I will check the units okay here is also inch so that's okay in the AutoCAD that is also inch so now I will go into the import uh, for the import you should save your mod uh, grid system into the DXF file so here is the DWG file so I will save as you can click from here and also from here save as here I will select DXF format so here I am saving my model into the DXF format save okay now I will again go file menu I will select import DXF file of architectural grid here I have select ok so my layer name of the grid system of all the grids is 0 so I have selected and the DXF file units also int so I will just hit ok so now the ETABS is saying please save your model so I am saving my model project one okay so now you can see all the grids are appeared here so here one two three but in the ETA, uh, in the AutoCAD that is a b c and the distance between them 15 feet 15 feet 10 feet so I can check into the added grid system data modify so here after clicking on display that is in system so I have to just convert back into the default units into fit so that I can check here is a 10 feet 15 feet 15 feet but uh, when you will go into the tabs so here you will see the spacing also in the X 10 feet 10 feet but in the Y direction 1 2 3 you can also name here as it is named in AutoCAD A B C so now we have imported as uh, we uh, seen in our uh, AutoCAD model so here A B C appearing in the end so I will also make it at start start so the model is now looking same as in the AutoCAD so you you will also face one error here is that so here is a spacing 3.0605 
why i am saying because when you see the um, i will click here you can see in the right uh, the, uh, there is a coordinates 3.06 that is not showing the 0 0 means its x and y is not at the 0 0 so how will you make it simply add it added grid storage data modify and you will put here with uh, x coordinate minus and the y coordinate minus so it will uh, put the x y coordinate system into 0 0 location so here I am putting minus 3.0605 that is the x here is minus 6.8813 okay so now i will hit okay okay now you can see the x and y in the e tabs uh, in the plan view there is x and y and the vertical direction there is z so here that is zero fit mm, that is nearly zero fit and you can see uh, if the y coordinate zero 15 feet and 30 feet so that's how you can make your x and y uh, coordinate system uh, to match your drawing.